Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your next fighter, making the walk to the cage in the blue corner, Jack Clark! Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome, making the walk to the red corner, William Timmons! Well, ladies and gentlemen, another bantamweight contest coming your way. Jack Clark representing Team Underground in the black trimmed with red Venom shorts as he takes on William Timmis from Primal Combat. <laughs> also in wearing the red black and, and red. Black shorts, but with a big old monkey on it for Primal Combat. Well. Look. Looks to me like Clark wants to use a kicking game. And Tim's wanted nothing to do with it. Shot in on a double on a duck under, and he secured side control. Yeah, and he's staying chest to chest, staying very sticky there. Is he going to look to... <coughs> thought he might look to put slide that knee on belly, but it looks to me like he's... I think one of the things as well is he can use this to burn out Clark's arm. You can only hold that position. You're not going to get a finish from it for so long before that arm starts getting tired. But look at Clark off his back. Like, just. And oh. Tim uses that aggression to pass. In the, in the half guard here. I'm enjoying the scrambles. Good control from William Timmis here. But Jack Clark, I mean, busy off his back, man. Throwing yep. little chopping shots. He, he's doing everything correctly. What he's trying to do is figure out ways to make Tims to make a mistake. So the best way to get out of mount, off your back, or anything else is to constantly move because it will force 
the guy that's on top of you to react, and it gives you that opportunity. But Tim's is just not letting it go. He wants this fight to be on the ground. He does not want any more of those kicks. And uh, again, from the moment that he initiated the first clinch, it's all him. Yeah. He's the one pushing forward. But as I say that, Clark staying busy off the back. It's yeah. just a guy winning his fight, winning the fight off the back. Yes, he yes, just got a is. knockout from his back. Oh, my God. He just got a TKO finish from his butt. I don't think I've ever seen a finish like that two today. I've had an inverted triangle, and I've had a knockout from the bottom position. What a phenomenal finish from Jack Clark. I, it, Clark was smart. He saw that he was in a trap position, and he continued to throw punches, and the punches started getting through. Once they landed, they put Tim's in a position where he couldn't respond anymore and got the finish. As we see it now, if you look, Clark is extremely busy from bottom hammer fisting the side of Tim's face. As we come up to the finish, you can see Tim's yeah. is done. Absolutely, what a phenomenal finish for Jack Clark. Let's turn it over to the MC and we'll make this one official. That was nice. Ladies and gentlemen, we bring you your winner after one minute and 59 seconds of the very first round, declaring your winner by way of TKO in the blue corner, Jack Clark. That was fun. They did everything fucking perfect. Those hammer fists were clean, nice, aggressive. Hopefully. <laughs> Fingers crossed the right Falco shows up. Make sure they Gregor is tough as nails, and if the Falco I've seen in the room shows up, phenomenal. I'm looking for this this is one of my dark horse fight of the night. Nice. If Charlie shows up, this is gonna be a good 